Hey guys, in this video, we are going to take a look at the Android 11 based Pixel Experience ROM for Redmi 5 Plus or the Redmi Note 5, codenamed as Wins. So, without wasting more time, let's start. So, guys, starting with the home screen, we have this beautiful wallpaper which is shot on Pixel, and we have a lot of wallpapers about that. You can check it in the styles and wallpapers. And in here, as you can see, we get a lot of wallpapers. Now, the live wallpapers lag a lot and it makes the uh, uh, UI actually non usable, so just uh, stay away from the live wallpaper. Also, on boot, you will get live wallpaper and you'll face UI lag issues. So, just set a wallpaper right from here, and you can uh, see this is the text. Uh, these are the like for fun wallpapers, the Pixel 5 wallpapers, which are earlier available to download. Then we have these landscapes, which is captured on Pixel, and I have set one, and it like, like the quality is really high resolution. So, I have set this one, it looks really nice on the home screen. Everything is visible, the text and all. Then, this is the home screen, the basic Pixel launcher. We don't have any extra settings with the Pixel launcher because you know Pixel launch, uh, Pixel experience is just for the stock Pixel experience, not for the features. Then this is the UI of the settings and in the about phone, this is the Android version, it says 11 and it comes with the 5 November latest security patch. Also comes with the Dark Ages Ultimo kernel which is the latest uh, Dark Ages update uh, kernel. And this is the 24, uh, 11, 24 November build, which is also, yeah, this is a, like the first build. So, yeah. So, guys, as this is Pixel experience, right from the UI, we get the Pixel UI, then the apps, we get the Google Pixel apps. Yeah, the stock uh, Google apps are here. Then the camera is the Google Camera Go. It works really fine. There are no issues with the camera, with the video and all that stuff. But if you want an advanced camera with advanced options, you can easily install the uh, Google Camera, the Gcam, modded Gcam. And I don't know if uh, any uh, like older versions work, but yeah, the recent versions should work fine with this ROM. So if you are using it on Android 10, the latest versions of the Gcam, then you can also install it on this Android 11 ROM. It should work. There should be like no issues at all. And you can just find any Gcam, the working Gcam on Telegram. So you can just join the groups and all that stuff and just get a uh, like working Gcam for this ROM. Now guys, as this is Pixel experience, we don't get like a lot of stuff, but yeah, just the basic stuff is present here. Uh, turn on the light when charging, which is the LED light charging, then battery percentage, and the full charge lasts about, it will tell you about your usage, how much it will last, like this device is actually on idle, so yeah, it will say it lasts like for four days, and screen users for now, it's just one hour, and I'm charge it full, so to check, but yeah, the battery, the deep sleep is everything fine so not much of issues are present then into sound we also have the live caption which you can enable and you can just uh, use it anywhere on any other apps so it's a really good option and yes it's from the pixel so it works totally fine and apart from that you get the basic gestures functionality this is the stockish ones we don't even have the three finger screenshot so yeah that's how stock pixel experience is and yep uh, that is it for the pixel experience we don't have face unlock here but yeah the fingerprint uh works fine as of now there are no issues with uh any other stuff everything is working fine just a bit of slutter and lag is there and also don't set live wallpaper it will like just freeze the ui and it will like slutter a lot like total hell of a lag so yep that is it now if you want to install this rom just uh follow this process like the installation is easy wipe and all that stuff but yeah just in case if you are installing android 11 for the first time i'll just uh, do it for you guys now first shut off your device like power off your device and press the volume up and home button uh to boot your device into custom recovery i am assuming you already have installed it i'm using the skyhawk recovery doesn't matter just use the latest uh, skyhawk or orange fox recovery then first of all back up your stuff because it's important back up your internal stuff because you know it's android 11 encryption may be broken so it will you know rip your internal storage and then you will blame me in the comment section so yeah i'm decrypted so there is no issues with me then first you have to uh, wipe this stuff advanced wipe these are the partitions i have to wipe then after wiping uh, okay Let's get back to install the pixel experience rom 
and just the pixel experience rom you have to flash there is nothing else to flash and if you want to flash magic just boot back into recovery mode and flash magic like in some cases if you flash it with the rom then it will not like you know get fully installed and then you have to again install it uh so yeah that's the issues with magic let's skip the installation so guys i had the reboot install after complete uh option enabled so it auto rebooted after installation and here is the google uh, boot animation the pixel boot animation what you can say and yeah that is it for the video if you guys really like this video you have to press the like button if not dislike button and you can post your feedback down below in the comment section also if you want to watch a lot of videos more upcoming videos on android 11 and other stuff about the redmi 5 plus or the redmi note 5 coordinate with wins you can just subscribe down below and I'll see you guys in the next video. Till then guys, take care and please wear a face mask. Bye-bye.